Hey guys, good morning. So in this video today, I have a very special guest with me. You may have met her uh, on the other day when we went to the monkey forest. She's not a monkey. Well, she's as much a monkey as I am. No, just get to it. So this is this is my friend Rasheen. Hello, hello, everybody. So, so I'm using this also as like a like a teaching moment because I I'm, I want to help Rasheen start her her YouTube her YouTube her Facebook page. Um, so Rasheen uh, has a really really beautiful like okay so you were telling me the other day like so Rasheen wants to start making videos and like can you tell me can you tell us like why do you want to make videos um well I just think there's a real gap in the market for um <clears throat> caring for us older women um you know there's there's just not enough out there if you look at like exercise videos you the, yeah the, okay first of all great there's no right answer there's no wrong answer mm -hmm. it's just like how do you want to do it okay like, you can yeah, talk to me wanna... you can talk to them like yeah yeah it's so... all it's all new i'm learning ava's uh, it's just amazing at helping me yeah. um yeah so I, I i think there's such a gap in the market like if you look if you go into youtube and um for a fitness video for older like over 40 over 50s or whatever it's all young people and um, who have not experienced what an older body is like so they don't know so i like my, I just feel, I, I, I've been a fitness teacher, I've been a yoga teacher, I've been a raw food chef, I've been a nurse, and it's like, why don't you put all these things together and share it? And um, yeah, so that's what I'm kind of starting out, and it's like the fear, oh, what am I gonna, you know, I'm, I'm too old, I'm too ugly, I'm yada, 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 I, you know, I don't wanna be seen in front of the camera, and. But I just want I just want to open that up and share it and um, just yeah just just share what what I I just have this yearning to share it. It's like it just keeps coming and it doesn't it doesn't stop. It's like you're supposed to friggin' do this, so do it. You're supposed yeah. to friggin' do it. Yeah, yeah. I, I like Jay Jay saying now there's a phenomenal idea. I've looked around and she's right. Mm. Yeah, so, um, so yeah, Roshi and I were talking and I had shared um, that I, you know, I make videos and, and, um, and so I'm happy, like, I'm, I love helping people like you, like, you're obviously, like, not in it, like, like, just for fame and ego, like, you genuinely want to, like, help others, like, specifically, like, middle-aged women and you have such a cool story, I mean, you're, you're living here in Bali now, mm. can you tell us a little bit about, like, like, you made the decision to leave with the UK and mm. move to Bali what was that yeah. like for you and, and at what age 60 at age 60 wow <laughs> yeah wow. it's either yeah it's re, re, either wise or really stupid <laughs> <laughs> one, one or the other and I yeah I went for I wrote to, to the raw food uh, school here the top one at um, Alchemy and asked if mm. I could be an intern they're usually about 20 something an intern and it's like me at 60 it's like yeah why not they can only say she can only say no and she said yes she said yes yeah oh cool so i decide i just packed i put everything in storage and i decided yeah i'm gonna go for it i had this passion for raw food for a long time i just loved it i had chronic fatigue for many years and i healed myself through food and well and just a different lifestyle and i i loved I loved it, so I decided to um, go and help them in the school, and um, and it was amazing. It was it was really incredible. How long? I love that you started an internship at age sixty, <laughs> which is also like so. Wait, did you do that because you wanted to learn, or you wanted to like do it, or like why? What what like made you want to do the internship? I think it's because I. I, yeah, I had been helping some somebody else in the UK, Kate Magic, she's really big, um, and I, we've travelled all over Europe, and I was helping her, and I just wanted to learn more, and I was so fed up of the UK, and the, the cold, and there was nothing happening there, mm -hmm. so I just thought, why not try, why not try? And were you scared? I was a bit scared, yeah, because I, I didn't know anyone, and um, but I had travelled the world on my own, so... Um, I've done crazy, crazy things, really, really mad things. So it, this was just another mad thing that I was doing. <laughs> and if it didn't work out, it doesn't. It didn't work out. You know, I could come back 
Thanks. You know, I like that. You know, I, I know there are, there are a lot of people who watch my videos and they see me doing crazy things and, and they, they say, oh, you're so, you're so brave to travel alone as a woman. You're so brave to do these things as a woman. Like, what do you, what, what do you think about, I mean, you're a woman coming here on your own, starting a new life in Bali. Like, what do you say to, some, to someone who's scared of, of doing that? Oh, just do it. Just do it. Because, you know, it's like, it's having those regrets later, it, I just never want those. Mm -hmm. I never want those in my life. So I've always done things that I really want to do. I've all, and, and I've had to compromise because I don't have kids, which I would have loved. And, you know, I don't have a husband um, anymore. I used to have a husband. And so I, I don't have the ties and I know a lot of people do, so it's more difficult. But just go for it because I'm just seeing more and more even as I get older that it's the dis it's the uncomfortableness that makes us grow the things yes. that, that yeah the go getting out of our comfort zone that's what makes us grow and that's what I feel more and more if, if I'm scared to do something I'm gonna blooming well like I didn't want to do this video she didn't want to do this video and it's like <laughs> I'm not saying no to stuff anymore I, I just want you. to I mean I'm you know gonna be 64 in November and I, I, yeah, I just, I just want to open yeah. everything up and, you know, be limitless as much as I can. Yeah, because this is your time. time. This exactly. is your time. It's always our time. Right now is our time for, for, for all of us. But yeah, and there isn't, you know, it's like I can have all the stories. Oh, but I'm too old and I'm too ugly and I'm, you know, and mo I mean, if you come to Bali, I mean, everybody, most people here are could be on the cover of Vogue. You know, when I walk into a yoga class with 75 absolute stunning looking men and women, but so, so friggin' what? You know, it's like, I, I, I just, yeah. So it, it takes, it takes courage and that's one of my values. One of my values is courage. And when I don't live that value, I, I, I spiral into a depression. You know, when I'm not living that value, you know, my, my value is, it, my values are courage, uniqueness, commitment, and wisdom. Mm. And, if, and if I'm not, if I'm not living them, I, I just spiral, you know? So, yeah. Well, you've definitely lived it, lived your values this morning. Thank you so much for, yeah, being Thank willing so to much, come on this, on this video. Yeah, for sure. So, so, um, yesterday I gave Roisin the, um, homework assignment of starting her Facebook page. So you did it. So it's called, I, I forgot to tag it, but I'm going to post it after so you can go find find the page. And I've offered her the invitation to the 30 day video challenge. Yeah, which is amazing to, to do. I'm I'm really excited. I Yeah, that's another thing. I, I love challenges. I love when someone asks me to do stuff. I love it. So yeah, I'm going to definitely do that. And just see, you know, what, what, what people want, what people need, mm -hmm. you know, because I, I haven't posted enough to see what is needed. And um, because I just, I just want to share all my, like my fitness knowledge, my yoga knowledge, mm -hmm. uh, my food. I, I love making food. I love making food from scratch. Like I made a tempeh video the other day, right from the soya bean to the plate mm. and it was it was yeah it was really really uh, I love sharing those kind of things with mm -hmm. people mm -hmm. yeah nice uh, Cecilia says thanks for being brave and doing the video with me yeah uh, you're so welcome and Isabel says I'm loving hearing your story and stop saying you're ugly that's not true <laughs> Don says love this yay uh, Lotus says I can't wait to hear more Aww, so these are some of the beautiful people that will that will jump over and watch your, your videos and follow your page and now it's just up to you we were talking about like you know what we can control and what we can't control can't control how people respond can't control how many people like and follow us can't control you know inevitably you're going to get some like shitty comments mm -hmm. probably probably not for a while though because mm -hmm. you're just kind of getting the nicest people here um you can't control any of that the only thing you can control is like did you show did you show up today yeah and you know so for the 30 day challenge, you know, it, the, the idea is, you know, you want to get yourself in the habit of, of making the videos that like we talked about. Like that, that's really the purpose is really just to, just to get yourself in that habit. And it's also good to know, like, you know, sometimes you may not want to make a video. That's going to be real. Yeah. I think for me, in my, in my experience, I think with the 30 day challenge, push through it because that's like the starting, the starting, 
starting grains. I don't know why it's grains, but yeah, yesterday I didn't make a video, but I also respect that, like, I'm in a certain sort of, like, contraction with all of, like, my recovery work and all the stuff that's coming up. So sometimes I make a video when I'm in that state, sometimes I, I choose to prioritize rest. So I think that's part of the, the discernment of, like, really coming to understand, like, mm -hmm. oh, please. Oh, excuse me. Like, what's, what's best? So it's, like, balance. And that's another thing with doing this is, like, you have to, because you will have people come and follow you now. It's important to understand the boundaries, mm. boundaries with yourself, boundaries with your audience, and making sure that you're taking care of yourself as you do this, because it's possible to become codependent with with an audience, like like, like we heard about. So, um, so yeah. So I know that there are a lot. I'm really excited to share Roshin with you guys because I know that there are a lot of middle-aged women out there who follow my my stuff who be super inspired by hearing about what you're talking about which is why like when she was you know i was asking her some questions when she was telling me i'm like yes this is great like this is a this is a voice that needs to be heard your voice like what you're what you carry matters yeah and i i think i think it's really important i've called it unique sisters because we all are amazing unique sisters and we all have things to share and sometimes like as we get older we kind of feel that it's you know it doesn't want to be heard but it does and because like we, we hold so much wisdom as well as we get older to the young to the younger yes. women like so many young women are so scared of like menopause for instance and it's like for me my experience was so beautiful and so easy mm. and you know maybe a younger woman might want to hear that mm -hmm. you know yeah um, so it's like yeah, it's just, and it, it, I think when when you're given, you know, a sort of a gift or a talent, you, you need to share what it is with, without, because I think not sharing it is is tragic. Yeah. It's tragic. Yeah. It's like taking the fruit away from the plant and not letting it plant and start the new, like the, the new growth. Yeah. It's like it's like robbing the tree of its fruit just to not share the wisdom. You know, that's not how nature works. It's like, yeah. Amazing, right? She's so, she's so great. Yeah, Cecilia says, this is so great. Such an important subject. Nice. Um, Melissa says, looking forward to, sh to hearing what you have to share. Nice. Thank you. Yay. I love you too, Vanessa. You actually, you know what you, you remind me, so I have this song. I'd like to sing a song now. Oh, <laughs> so here's a song that has been kind of like my, my mantra, my motto. It goes like this. Celebrate the voices of my sisters. What you carry matters. Celebrate the voices of my sisters. I want to hear your song. I celebrate the voices of my sisters. What you carry matters. I celebrate the voices of my sisters. Together we are strong. Thank you. I mean, it's like, what is, what is amazing is that we're, we're all different, right? We all, what we carry matters. Like what you carry does not need to be what she's carrying or what he's carrying in order to have value. Like what you, like trust in the seed that you're carrying, right? Like your higher power gave you like, this unique seed, like this unique mission. And it's like your mission is to just trust in the seed and like carry it and plant it and let it grow and cultivate it. And like, and together, it's like to, together we are, we are the forest. You know, and like, and that's that's the purity. Absolutely, yeah, totally. Yay! Thank you so much. Cool. All right, guys, I we're gonna wrap this video up, um, and I'm going to uh, share her page. So it's called Unique Sisters Roisin. It 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 kind of is spelled like Roisin, but yeah, Roisin. Yeah, it's Irish Gaelic. Uh, Gaelic. Oh. Roisin. And yeah, can you, so you're, can you just tell us a little bit about where you're from? Like, what's your ethnicity? So, my mom was Indian, and she uh, grew up in Sri Lanka, and my dad was Irish. Oh, mm. very cool. Where did they meet? In Switzerland. Oh. And the first night that they met, my, my mom was from a very wealthy Indian family, and my dad was doing his hotel management. And the first night they met, um, they met through, I don't know, it was a hotel or something. He asked her to marry him. And she said yes on the first night. The first what? night, it was all it was all tongue in cheek, and it wasn't. But then you know. But then a few months later, they got back together in London, and then she found 
it, it's an amazing story. I'll, I'll, you, I'll that, 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 that could be a video in videos. itself. It's an amazing story. Wow. Yeah. It's wow. really an incredible story. But yeah, so they met, they met there. And, um, and yeah. that's one of the many reasons why you're so cool and so interesting. You have so much to share. Well, I, I, so, I, yeah, I want to share so much. So thank you for listening to me. Yeah, awesome, thank guys. Thank you for, for, for um, shooting this. It's so beautiful. Yeah. It's really generous and kind. And, yeah, I, I love your, your videos are amazing. Amazing. Very unique, very, very authentic because I mean, every every Tom, Dick, and Harry is making a video these days. But it's like when you when you when there's like a uniqueness and a realness to a video, then that's the power. Mm -hmm. It's the power. That's yeah. what I see. That that the, 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 that's where the power is. If there's a if there's an iota of like ego in it, it doesn't it doesn't work. People mm. people will, people will sense it. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I think I I think I I have had that. Where it's like, oh, I want to see how many likes, I want to see da 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 da, -da. and that is so much energy. It is. I don't want to waste my energy like that. No. Yeah. yeah. There are so many conversations that we're that we're gonna have. I'm glad that I'm still here for a few more weeks. So this is good. You can get your videos started. We can circle back. I, I told Rasheen I'll be I'll be her her personal coach, her her for for the videos. So. Hello, no, thank some, you. We're going to make some really amazing food. Um, yeah, going to make some beautiful, like you, people love you won't believe it's raw. Okay. When I make it for you, yeah. Okay, it sounds great. Mm. Sounds great. Okay. Yeah, exactly. Uh, Melissa, women empowering women. Melissa is really cool. She um she she lives in the United States and she sources like uh, artisan handmade crafts by women like in Guatemala where I oh, live wow. and then she she sits them and then she sells them. And her specific thing is she wants to like empower women. Like beautiful. You know, That's yeah. beautiful. Yeah, we have a lot of we have a lot of really amazing women on yes. this channel. And men too. We have a lot of really amazing humans, people, beings on this channel. So yeah, I'm happy. And guys, I'm so happy to introduce you to to her because I really just feel like yeah, you, you guys can all benefit from from meeting each other. So mm. so yeah, so I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go and share. Um, I'm gonna go share her her page. So just it's it's called Unique Sister Roisin, um, and she just posted she just started her page yesterday and posted her first video. So stay tuned. She's gonna she's doing the 30 day video challenge. So every day you can come back and expect a video. And give her some love and give her some encouragement and some support. And if there's anything that you want to know, maybe you can ask her questions to give her oh, ideas yeah, for definitely. for other videos. You know, so I'm so open to yeah whatever whatever people would like me to share about. I would love to. Yeah, thank awesome. you. Cool. Okay. All right, guys. Bye. Bye, Bye everybody. Bye.